Hi everyone, Ryan Ratliff here from Mad River Outfitters. Today we got some sweet stuff to talk about from Renzetti and some of the new ways to kind of uh, mod up your vise. That's like butter. But before we get started, let's have a word from our sponsors. Mad River Outfitters. Mad River Outfitters has a great line of great new t-shirts. Oh look, here's one. This is one of my favorites, especially because it's got this really cool musky on the back. Mad River Outfitters, the greatest t-shirts in the world. Okay, so some sweet ways to mod up your vise uh, from Renzetti. They're doing a great job. Uh, we have a great uh, relationship with them. Lily and Andy have provided us with some awesome material and it's really easy for us to sell great stuff. So. Uh, most of us here at the shop stand behind uh, our vices that we tie on and it's going to be a Renzetti. One of the cool things that we like about Renzetti is that it's simple and it actually holds the platforms that we like to tie on. So we've had a great relationship with them for a long time. Uh, they are in Titusville. So as we speak, they actually are having the hurricane come through. So definitely kind of crazy stuff going on down there. But uh, they manufacture their all the stuff all the vices, their tools, in-house there. Uh, they get maybe get anodized somewhere else, but they, they are definitely doing a great job pressing forward with that. And the phone rings. Also some cool things that Brian's got going on with them. He's doing a class with Flip, and they're actually gonna be just north of there, or just in that area. Doing that class, they're gonna have a tour of the factory, just a private tour with that class, him and Flip. At, at the Renzetti factory. So it's pretty cool stuff going on. All right, let's jump right in. All right, so the first thing, this is our saltwater traveler that we have here. This has the bigger base on it. We'll get to that in a second. Uh, the first thing that's that we'd like to talk about tonight or today is the new Game Changer Jaws. This is something we've been waiting for for a long time. The Game Changer Jaw has been out for a while, but not this size. This is the saltwater size. So this is what would fit right in here. You just undo this screw, pull the old jaw off, drop that one in, screw goes right into there, and it's gonna hold the shanks. You can see how it's got a different little notch in there compared to the original. And that's gonna hold the shank at a, the perfect angle to tie on. Blaine's gonna talk about all that. I'm not gonna go into too much detail on that, but that's the main key feature on that. So if you tied with shanks before, you know that it holds them at a weird angle once you start doing the game changer platform. That is the key. If you don't have a saltwater traveler, but you maybe have a master vise, they did just come out with this too. You could see the different quality difference, a lot higher quality uh, material here, obviously with the cam, all that type of stuff. So this is for your master. Doesn't matter if it's a special edition or just a regular master, this is the game changer jaw for that. So same exact type of thing. Undo this, it's a little bit different how it's held into the master, it kind of slides in. Uh, it comes with a little spring that fits into that spot there. There's a little paper in the package that tells you how to do it. Obviously give us a call if you got questions. If you just have a regular presentation 4000, here's the jaw for that. Again, this has been out for a little bit. Presentation 2000, jaw here. And then just the regular Traveler 2000, 22, 2300, that, that's the jaw there. So those are the game changer jaws. They're very simple to put in. Obviously, if you have questions, give us a call here at the shop. But basically, it's just a screw. Off comes the old one, on goes the new one. And it's a great feature when you're tying those platforms. One question I do get a lot of times is, what size hook range can I put in here? You can still fit the same size hooks uh, with this kind of notched out spot on the saltwater and the master. It's a little bit skinnier, so sometimes you might be able to tie on different designs on smaller hooks too. So just an added feature, uh, but it'll still hold all the regular hooks, so you don't have to swap back and forth. So cool thing there. A couple other things that are awesome that are that are out are these new toolbars. These are fantastic. They have a special feature, unlike other toolbars in the market. This one has, when it goes on the stem, when you tighten this down, it actually squeezes down around the stem. So it holds it very, very firm. 
And on this side here, this is so you can add your parachute posts. So if you put it on the, on the stem, you can have a parachute post come up, a back plate or profile plate, whatever you want to call it. Really, really cool. They're spaced out perfectly for bobbins to be side by side. Even has a notch for scissors, which is kind of unique also. All kinds of different types of things. Comes in a couple different sizes. So this is the four inch in clear. This is the six inch in purple. You can also see on the sides there, there are different metric and standard measurements. So that is a handy feature. Here's black. Here is blue. This one just came out, just got released, and there will be a green one eventually. So uh, really cool. All of them come in four and six inch sizes. You can see the website there for what's available. Um, and they are the best toolbars on the market. All right, a couple other things that you can help, uh, that help make tying a little bit easier and modding out your vise. So you have the rotary piece here, that the little arm that helps you um, hold on to it as you rotate around. Uh, some people like to have a 90 degree angle there. So for this saltwater traveler, there is this 90 degree arm. Super simple, you just unscrew this knob, this slides in. If you have a regular traveler, it's the same thing. This is a little bit bigger on the saltwater. The smaller one there on the regular traveler, unscrew that, slips in there. Same size for the regular travelers and the saltwater travelers. And that helps you Helps you spin, spin around, around in circles, yes. Can you say it helps you spin it around, right round, baby, right round? No, I can't say that. It, this spins around on there, so when you put it on, it goes. So if you, just like this. It doesn't make any noise, so it's not as fun. All right, so if you have a master vise, uh, with the master, it has a lot higher quality a piece in the back. It's kind of like you can ratchet with it. This has roller bearings inside of it. Really, really fancy. It's got the Renzetti logo on the side. Same exact thing. You're gonna take off the back part there, slide this on, and it will still allow you to do the ratcheting type action. So um, if you use that, most of us just lock it tight. So this is the, the nice one there for the master. So last thing I wanna talk about is this awesome base. This base is six by eight. It weighs a thousand pounds. No, not really. It weighs uh, way more than any other pedestal on the market. Um, it is fantastic. It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to walk on the table. It comes in a lot of different sizes. No, not sizes. It comes in a lot of different colors. So here is my favorite. This is the sea foam. It also comes with this magnet that has a measurement on there. And then these two pockets on the side here, you can flip it over. There's the rare earth magnets. So you can see that those two pockets are magnetized. This will fit on any traveler, any of your, actually any vice that holds a 3 8 inch stem. So you don't have to have a Renzetti to have that base. There's a lot of people who go with other brands that I'm not going to mention right now that uh, use that base because it is one of the best on the industry right now. Renzetti is bringing the base. I think something like that, I don't know. All right, deleted scene. I wanna talk about this extended arm addition to the vise. You can see how short this arm is here. Regular size flies that you're tying, no problem, most everything that you're doing. As you tie the bigger game changers, they start to get longer and longer. This is, adds an extra inch to the whole thing. So super easy to do. You can see that there's threads here. You just unscrew this piece here. Off comes all this, slide this in, screw all this back on, super easy to do. This is for the travelers. So this is the blacked out one. I also have one in clear or silver, however you wanna say it. Uh, and this fits all the different travelers. So that's some awesome stuff from Renzetti. Different ways to mod out your vise. You got questions, give us a call. As always, uh, definitely give us a call. Ben will talk to you. No, any one of us will talk to you. But um, make sure that you click that like button, I think is clicking, right? I think, I don't know. Leave a comment. Don't mention anything about how I look, but leave a comment um, and make sure you subscribe. All right, thanks a lot. Next time, see ya. And watch these videos and something over here or somewhere. I don't know what's going on. So, yeah, something like that. Renzetti's bringing the base. And Renzetti's bringing the base.